So you have a ton of speech recorded for your podcast or audiobook, and you have some loud, annoying breathing in there. I used to go through this all manually myself and remove it, so let me save you that pain and show you a quick and easy way of removing the breathing automatically. In order to remove the breathing from our audio, we're going to be using the free software Audacity. So go to your browser and search for Download Audacity and head to the Audacity download webpage. The version I'm using is a Mac, so I'll download that version. Just click Download Audacity for Windows, Mac or Linux. This will take you to fosshub.com and download the relevant version for your operating system. So then when you've downloaded the installer, just double click on this and follow the steps to install Audacity on your computer. Once you've installed Audacity, just open it up and take a look. You can import your recorded audio by going to File, Import, Click Audio, and then choosing your audio file. I have a test piece of audio here, so let's just look at where the breathing is, waveform decibels. We can see here, here's my speech. In between the speech, we have the breaths, and it's also the same here. Um, let's just have a listen. So I want to check. I want to check. Okay, and let's just see the volume of uh, of that breath by looking here. So it just comes to below negative 42 decibels. So what we want to do is select the entire audio by just either clicking here or pressing Command A on a Mac or Control A on Windows, presumably. And we want to apply a noise gate to cut off anything of around this sort of volume. Um, the only problem is when you select the entire track and you go to effect, um, not everyone has the noise gate in their version of Audacity. So if you haven't got the noise gate, let me quickly show you how to get that. So open up your browser and search for Nyquist noise gate plugin. This will bring you to the wiki pages and we want to jump to the noise gate. And then we'll just download the noise gate plugin by clicking download. So once you have your noise gate plugin file, we want to transfer that to Audacity. In, uh, in a Mac, you have to go to Applications, right-click Audacity and Show Package Contents, Open Up Contents, go to your plugins and transfer the uh, NoiseGate plugin file to this folder here. For Windows, uh, just do the same, but transfer it to the relevant directory. Now when we're in Audacity, in order to enable that plugin, you go to Effect, Add Remove Plugins, as you transfer the plugin file to uh, the relevant folder, it should show up here. Here it is. And if it's not enabled, you just want to click Enable and then OK. So now we've installed the NoiseGate plugin and enabled it. Let's use it to remove the breathing in this audio track. So select All or Command A, go to Effect and choose NoiseGate. So with these settings, keep them all the same. Select Function, Gate, Stereo Linking, Link Stereo Tracks, No. Gate frequencies above zero, uh, level reduction negative 12 decibels, and the attack and delay is 250 milliseconds. So this is the volume that we're going to gate below. And as you can see, the breathing was just below negative 42. So just to uh, be liberal, let's say, let's set that to negative uh, 35, see what happens. Negative 35, okay. And as you can see, that's really brought down the size of the breath. So let's just have a listen. Studio. I want to check out what it's like. Yeah, and that's really brought down the volume of our breathing so that it, so that it doesn't distract from our speech. Here, so I'm just rec so there you go. Here's a really quick way of removing all those breaths from long segments of recorded audio. From here, all you need to do is click File, Export, Export as MP3, export it to the relevant uh, folder in whatever settings you want, save, and then enter your details as you want, and just click OK and that will export to MP3. If you want more information on recording and producing professional sounding speech, check out my course. It's called Self Produce, a high quality audiobook at home on a budget. Also check out my book and audiobook on Amazon. It's called The Talent Hacker's Guide.